Calculation of the gaining ratio when new profit sharing ratio of the partners is given. Now in this case what happens is let's first read the question Ram, Sham and Mohan who are partners in a firm share profits and losses in the ratio of 3 is to 5, 1 is to 5, 1 is to 5 or 3 fifth, 1 fifth and 1 fifth. Mohan retires from this firm and Ram and Sham decide to share the future profits and losses in the ratio of 4 is to 3. You are required to calculate the gaining ratio of the partners if any. So we have three partners here Ram, Sham and Mohan and you are given that their existing profit sharing ratio is how much? 3 upon 5 for Ram, 1 upon 5 for Sham and 1 upon 5 for Mohan. Now Mohan retires from the firm okay and Ram and Sham decide to share the future profits and losses in the ratio of 4 is to 3. So new profit sharing ratio between Ram and Sham is given as 4 is to 3 or you can write this as 4 by 7 and 3 by 7, 7 being the sum of the two numerators, right? Now you are told to find out the gaining ratio. What is gaining ratio? Gaining ratio is nothing but the new profit trading ratio minus the existing sharing ratio. So if on an existing basis I got 3 fifth and now I am getting 4 seventh, I need to see if I have made any gain. So the gaining ratio for Ram is equal to the new profit sharing ratio minus the old 35 is the LCM of 7 and 5. This divided by 7 gives you 5 fours are 20 minus 21 or minus 1 by 35. So actually Ram has made a loss. Similarly, let's see for Sham, 1 upon 5 is his existing ratio, sorry. His new ratio is 3 by 7 minus 1 upon 5. 5 times 3 gives you 15 minus 35, 7 times 7 times 1 gives you 7. 8 by 35. Right? So actually, Sham is gaining and Ram is losing. Right? So effectively, there is no gaining ratio. Whereas, Sham has made a gain of 8 is to 5. Okay, so effectively the ratio is minus 1 is to 8, which means Ram did not make any gain, whereas Sham gained 8 by 35. Right?